Rob, I can tell you detectives have left the scene, but there is still a active police presence out here where the shooting happened. About a half block section of Crown Point remains closed off. It's been this way for nearly five hours now. Omaha police responded here to 25th and Crown Point to a shot spotter activation. It was just after five o'clock. People down the street heard the gunshots. We were sitting outside on the porch and uh, we walked inside and Pretty much as soon as I got into the living room, uh, we heard three or four gunshots. The shots it took the Replogals by surprise. They say it was quiet beforehand. When we came back out, um, there was a red Jeep that was down there, and he drove really fast that way. And then there was like a cream color car going that way really fast. Multiple witnesses tell me there was a Jeep on the street along with another car, and both took off after the gunshots. Police aren't commenting what happened here, but we do know two people shot in this neighborhood were found in a car about a mile away outside Blackburn High School at 26th and Hamilton. One of the victims is shot in the arm, the other more critically hurt, taken to Nebraska Medicine with CPR in progress, eventually dying from the injuries. Back at 25th and Crown Point, investigators scoured the scene, taking pictures and marking evidence, much of the time also talking with potential witnesses. A few houses down, neighbors say it's all just a little too close. Just not something you're used to here? Or? Not really. No, I mean, every once in a while you might hear it in the distance, but not, not on the, the street. same street. People who were shot, nor have they given any information on possible suspects. If you know something, call Crime Stoppers. Information leading to an arrest could lead to a reward of $25,000. Live at 25th and Crown Point tonight, James Wilcox, KTV News Watch 7.